Hey, it's Cooking with Cad. We're back. It's been a while. Today, we're not doing anything complicated at all, but you wanted to do a video, didn't you? He said, Dad, when are we gonna do a video? I said, you know what? We'll do one today. And we're in a really good mood, aren't we? Two reasons why. Our Cowboys are 2-0 and with two division wins already. I know it's only two games, but I likes what I see so far. Hopefully it'll be 3-0 next week against the hapless Miami Dolphins who have yet to score a touchdown this year. So anyway, Cowboys 2-0, looking good. And the other reason, why are we happy? The second reason, because D-Ray had his first touchdown of the season today. I know, yeah, we forgot, cooking with Cat. I know we have some new subscribers. Why do we call it Cooking with Cat? I have two sons, Caleb and Dustin. This is Caleb. Say hi, Caleb. Hi, Caleb. Behind the lens as always. Say hi, Dustin. Hi, Dustin. Dustin was a beast today. His team scored three touchdowns. He accounted for all three of them. My favorite is this one right here. Watch the right side. Watch the weak side. Oh. Oh. Yeah, yeah! That was a beautiful pass, wasn't it? Yay, yay! That was his first of three today. Didn't he play awesome? Yeah. Yeah! Are you going to be just like Big Brother one day in football? Yes, and then I'm going to run with my long legs. You think so? All right. So, here's what we're doing tonight. We've got ten patties that we're going to do on the Blackstone griddle. This is all I am going to season them with and some pepper, of course, as well. And then here we've got some chicken fajitas. Bye. And I'm going to put a little bit of this on it because this is good grub. So, like I said, nothing earth shattering, but the boys wanted to do a video. So let's get to cooking. Blackstone, right? Say Blackstone. Blackstone. Blackstone is bad. Yes. All right, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use a little Kerrygold butter, which is my mm. favorite. Be careful, K-Bob. And we... Let's spread it around. Oh, look at that, look at the bubbles. The yep, we're gonna spread it around. Bubbles like it's hot. <laughs> yeah. All right, so there's the butter on that side. Now on this side, oh. we're gonna do a little oil. oil. We're gonna do the chicken on this side and, and the then. patties on the other. I'm gonna tell you what, we're gonna start the patties. with these patties. Man, those are gonna look good. Those are gonna be good? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, oh, that, and What's we, up? And we, we forget our parts. What parts? Um, Our parts that we need to start are me and Dustin. Hi, Caleb. Yeah. That part you're We already did that in the kitchen, remember? You think so? Yes. Okay. Say hey, Caleb. Hey, <laughs> Say hey, Dustin. Hey, Dustin. <laughs> All right. So there we go. Hello, We've got the burgers. Press that together just a bit. Hello, K-Bob. Hello, K-Bob. Over here. Uh, I, I'm not Caleb now. I'm, I'm bloop, bloop, here. bloop, bloop, bloop. Come on. Work with me. Chicken. Oh, it smells good, huh, Bubba? Mm -hmm. yeah. Smell good, Caleb? Yeah. Okay, so that we're gonna keep there. Chicken with chicken, beef and beef, because guess what, Dustin? I don't want my burgers with a side of salmonella. Uh -oh. No, it's no good, bro. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna let these cook. Those are gonna stay on for just a bit, and we'll keep cooking. Ha. Habachi? Habachi? What's up, sous chef? Got my sous chef. How about you, Bob? Burgers, look at this. Mm. Nice bubbling. Woo, with that butter on the bottom, bro. Mm. All right, let's see what we got. Yeah, we're going to have to flip them another time on each side. Nikki, my wife, we need to cook hers a little more than we would ours because I like mine medium rare. Nikki likes hers a little more medium. Isn't that right, D-Ray? Mm -hmm. And Caleb, what all do you like on your burger? Um, ketchup and, and, and 
and the patty. Ketchup and the patty? Yeah. That's it? Yeah. And no mayonnaise, no mustard, no cheese? No. No? Hey, you know what? That's the great thing about cooking with Cad. Nikki, Dustin, and Caleb. It's like Burger King. They get it how they want it. So they let me know how they want it, and I cook it that way for them. Oh, Dustin, did you see it slid right mm. off the grill? Look at that. And remember, we're using the tongs for the chicken mm -hmm. and the spatula for the beef. That way we don't cross-contaminate anything. Hold that for me again, my little sous chef. All right, so I don't want to press these down because that's going to do what, Dustin? Let the juice out. Let the juice out. And do we want the juice on the black top or in our bellies? In our bellies. In our bellies. All right. Ooh, let the juice out. Not, not us. All right, so we've got that going. Listen to that sizzle. And guys, if y'all don't have a Blackstone, man, I highly recommend it. It is such a blast to cook on. We're using propane outside. That's it with the extreme close up. Instead of using electricity inside the house, especially if we were doing this on a stove top, we'd be wasting electricity, getting the house warm as well. Dustin's taking liberties with the filming tonight, so those are looking really, really good. We've got some uh, Havarti cheese because it's so creamy. We also have medium cheddar. We also have pepper jack. So and once we get inside, we're going to slice those up and let people go to town on whatever cheeses they want to top these with. And? And? Did you forget what you were going to say? Oh, how about you, Roomba? Let's flip it. Let's eat. Oh, right on top of the other one, Hibachi. Caleb loves it when I say Hibachi and when we get our flip on. Dustin, these are looking pretty good. They're just about done. Seriously, take a look at getting one of these Blackstone griddles. Anything you can do on a stove top. You can do with this bad boy and it's just fun to get outside and cook with the boys yeah. that's why we named our channel cooking with cat a lot of people i knew especially family members said why don't you do big phil's barbecue or sharp barbecue or sharp barbecue number one we knew the channel was going to be about cooking and not just barbecue even though i specialize in barbecue we knew it was going to be a whole gamut of cooking and number two when i came up with cat I thought it really had a nice ring to it, cooking with Cad, and it's a nice way to honor my boys, if you will, cooking with Cad, Caleb, and Dustin. What do you think? It's a great name, don't you think? Yep. Caleb and Sharp. Caleb and Sharp. All right, let's check on the fajitas real quick, Dustin. These are getting close to being done, bro. Ooh. And I tell you what, the only thing that would make this Blackstone griddle. You want to take a guess, D-Ray? No. No? Uh, uh. Smell-o-vision. Uh, right? Yeah. If somehow the Blackstone could tie into the iPhone to where you could smell what Big Phil is cooking, man, you would be lined up in our driveway with your knife and fork or just your hands ready to rub down. So we're going to let these go a bit more, and then we'll pull them off, take them into the kitchen, and top them with cheese. Because I ain't eating no buns. Buns have carbs. Carbs create boobies. And I don't need bigger boobies. Check it out. Check, 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 check it out. Chicken. Hey. Chicken. Any Beastie Boy fans out there? All right, while you're here, North Texas Barbecue Addicts, go check them out. I'm on a member on Facebook. No, you don't have to live in North Texas to be a member of North Texas Barbecue Addicts. They're like 34,000 strong as far as members go now. So go hit them up. Two thumbs up. Yeah. All right. Chicken. Check, 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 check it out. Done. Burgers done. Here's Mama's, probably these two that are a little more well. Havarti, because why, Dustin? It's so creamy. Here, mild cheddar. And I know you're probably asking, this guy's a rookie. He didn't put the cheese on top of the meat. Mm. This guy doesn't like cheese. So to avoid any conflicts, 
with his burger, which he just likes. He already told you, just with catsup. Educated people say catsup, right? Catsup. So that way he doesn't freak out and say, no, 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 I don't want cheese on mine, daddy. I don't put cheese on any of them. And then what I do is I put the oven on broil. And, and whoever wants cheese, we put it on cheese, pop it in there for about 20 seconds, and voila, check, cheese check, check is out. melted. So anyway, there you go. Quick, easy, carb-free dinner for those of you that are doing keto like Mio. Was that funny? And we're probably gonna upload a video in a couple of days. It's gonna be a delicious mushroom sauce that we made last night to use with our pot roast. It's yummy. It will go fantastic. Yes, Nikki. Nikki's right over there. Show Nikki. Show Nikki. Show her. I'll give you 10 bucks. <laughs> There's Nikki. There's Mama Cad. So anyway, we are going to do that for our next video. Subscribe if you haven't. Smash a thumbs up. How many thumbs up? Two thumbs up? Yeah? And we'll see you guys again on the next episode of Cooking with Cad. Bye-bye.